Hello and welcome to the Calibre How-To video series. Today we will look at how to load Tickle customization files with the new Calibre Interactive GUI. I have opened a design in Calibre Design Rev from which I have launched the classic Calibre Interactive DRC GUI. I can access the custom GUI by clicking on the customization page in Calibre Interactive, which opens the custom GUI as a standalone dialog. The classic GUI enables users to write Tickle code to generate a custom GUI to set up options and deck switches for a Calibre run on a single page. Let us now see how we can load this Tickle custom file in the new Calibre interactive GUI, which uses a Qt framework. I have a setup file to start the new GUI and load the custom file. The first step is to set an environment variable to invoke the new GUI. The next step is to simply invoke the Calibre Interactive Executable by pointing to the classic run set and custom files. Let me run this setup file. The new Calibre Interactive GUI opens with the custom GUI loaded. I'm opening the classic custom GUI to have a side-by-side -side comparison of the two custom GUIs. The custom GUI is a native part of New Calibre Interactive and not a standalone dialog like in classic Calibre Interactive. This enables users to easily switch between the different pages of the Calibre Interactive GUI. The new GUI is backward compatible with classic run sets and tickle customization files, enabling users to easily launch the new GUI using those files. I hope you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching.